Here's a little garden tip. From our garden to yours. I've got a fun topic for us this time, making New Year's resolutions. We all make them, right? Well, if you're like me, I have a hard time keeping I often can't, but don't worry. Luann Duncan's here with her family and consumer sciences <laughs> department, and she's going to help us keep them, right? Well, I'm going to do my best. <laughs> <laughs> now, what I want to know yeah. mm -hmm. is how did this tradition ever get started? You know, I'm not sure I know how it ever got started, yeah. but, you know, we always want new beginnings. We sometimes want to just put the past behind us and say, I want to better myself and I want to start here. And when, why not? The New Year's is a new time. That's right. So we can go ahead and make the resolutions now. Yes. You know, do we always keep them? That becomes the other problem. What, what, what's the most common resolution? At the top is always lose weight, yeah. eat better, take better care of myself, yeah. and then the others, like spend more time with my family, those kinds of things come in, but you those see, are all at the top. You see, mine is to take better care of my plants, and I kind okay. of falter there too. <laughs> right. It's, a, it's to improve how we do things, whatever it is we do with and what's important to us. Yeah. So so what are some of the things we can do? I mean, let's say if we want to take get better care of our health, or what are some of the things? See, that's such a broad topic. I'm I know. going to take better care of my health. Yeah. Well, we know what we're doing and probably should change. We all know what our bad habits are. We all have them, myself included. So what? why don't we break it down. Rather than okay. I'm going to be healthier this year, I'm going to live healthier. What's one little thing you can something do? Something small or yes. some small. Well, I think that's yeah. reasonable. Because okay. we have habits and it takes six to eight weeks typically to change a bad habit into a good habit. So why not just pick that one little thing to start with? And then if we have that under control, pick another little thing. So, um, and you take a look at your personal health background. Mm -hmm. where, where do you think it might be an issue? Do you have a family who has high blood pressure? Is that something that you need to think about? Do you, are you from a family of diabetics? Do you have to watch your sugar? Or you're in good health and your family's in good health, but do I exercise enough? Yeah, something, something realistic. And, and I think right. some of these things, you know, always need to deal with, especially when it comes to our health. That's important. Yes. You've got some examples of different things here. Right. Well, and one up. of our biggest problems in our country today, and we've heard about it a lot, and that's childhood obesity, obesity across the board. And one of our issues is soda pop. Mm -hmm. People have gone to drinking that rather than having um, milk or water. And for years, we gave children fruit juice thinking we were giving them the healthy thing. And it, it's a little bit more healthy, but it's still very high in sugar. So if you drink two okay. 12 ounce Some cans, bag of sugar there. You're, okay. drink, you're drinking that amount of sugar in a month. Wow, and if that's you, a lot of sugar. That's a lot of sugar. And if you convert that sugar into fat because you haven't exercised it off, this is the amount I of fat. I love this. I love this. Yeah. So that's the amount of fat that you could accumulate in one month? In one month. Wow. That's amazing, isn't yes. it? That amount there. So what do you suggest we do? If we want to change that habit there, drinking two sodas, what should we start to do then? Okay, well, obviously, if you have it there looking at you in the refrigerator mm -hmm. when you go, put something in front of it. Don't mm -hmm. have it there if you can, but most people go in cold turkey. It doesn't work for them. Yeah. So can you go from two cans to one? Yeah. And then can you go to maybe, when I was little, we got a little glass of pop. That I was can, our big thing. I can do that, I think. Yeah. What else we got over here? We got. Uh, um, well, if you have high blood pressure, try substituting different herbs. Ex mm -hmm. Explore. See what you can do. Have different kinds of substitutes for salt on the table instead. And then, um, obviously, when you go to turn on the TV, have I have an exercise band, but have some kind of a reminder because we can exercise while we're yeah. watching TV. Is that TV. what this is here? Yeah, those yeah. are How's resistance bands. You got band. a demonst demonstration? <laughs> yeah, I want to well, see this Well, yeah, right. <laughs> right now, I mean, it's you get down on the floor. Oh, you know, I don't know I how to, you know, just different oh, kinds okay. of movements and stretches. And that's just one of many kinds of things. Wow. That's what I enjoy. And I, I think mean. it needs to be something you have fun mm -hmm. doing. If it's dancing to music or doing something, it doesn't have to be out running or jogging. It, start with something you know you'd have fun with. Now, you got some classes. It. Right? We have classes at the extension office on all of these different topics. Call us and find out what they are. We have things on the, the blood pressure, the diabetes, preparing healthy meals. Call us and we'll try to help. Good. Luann, thank mm -hmm. you very much. Thank and you. Uh, I'm making a New Year's resolution. Don't worry, little plant. I'm going to take better care of you. Right. <laughs>